I was so blown away by our next guest the last time he was here that I got him back here as soon as I could possibly get him back here from the Philadelphia Eagles. Please welcome magician John Dorenbos. Congratulations. So you won. You you beat the Falcons on, yeah. on Sunday. That's a good team, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah I know. Good team, so yeah. uh, we were pretty excited about good that. Good job. Yeah, thanks. All right. Uh, so uh, you're, you're, he's amazing. I can't believe you're a professional football player and then you do this. You're amazing. You know what? It's a pretty good gig. Yeah. <laughs> I'll take it. Uh, here, here's what I want to do, because I'm really excited to show you this. Last time I was here, you know I'm a shuffling guy. Yeah. So just say stop. Stop. OK, take it, look at it, show the camera, and then show everybody at home. OK, everybody got it? Yeah? yeah. OK, good, good, good. Now, yep. uh, put it right here. All right, now this is a normal shuffle, and this is what's really cool. Uh, you'll notice this. Both the halves are face down. You got it? So when I shuffle them, everything looks normal. Huh? Yep. Okay, good talk. If we do this, <laughs> this is when you take some face up, some face down, and you actually do what's called the slop shuffle. And we actually shuffle these together like this, and it's sloppy. See that? Right. Ooh. And then we kind of show these guys like this, and you can see they're all mixed up. Right. To find it, I need you to name your card, because I'm not that good to find it. I told you that last time, so just name it. Uh, six of spades. It's a riffle. Hopefully, we can get them all to go back in order, except that six of spades, and then we can find your card. Okay, okay, thank you. Now, hold on. Now, I'll tell you why that's not that good. I'll tell you why that's not that good, because you didn't know what to expect, so I caught you on the offbeat. So we're gonna do this together. Some halves face down, some face up, some face down, some face up. And you see these two piles like yeah. this? Look, we're gonna shuffle them together, and this time you can see what's gonna happen. Right. Ooh. See that? Yeah. I tell you what, why don't you do this? Look, look, look. Okay. Why don't you take these two halves and just kind of push them together? All right. Yep. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. I did uh, it. Yeah, that was, that was really good. Yep. I tell you what, let's have more fun. Watch this. Why don't you take these and just kind of toss these in there? Like, take some of those, or just some of there, some of there, some of there, and see so you go. So just okay. take them and go. Okay, all right. There. Perfect. Okay, good, good, good. Yeah. <laughs> and now we're going to square these up. Now, this is a lot harder because this usually takes me one or two shuffles. It's still over here. Oh, no. <laughs> okay, we'll figure that out. Well, I can't find it again, so I told you what I thought I'd do. Even with you shuffling, because you picked a spade, I thought I'd put them all in order except all the spades and put the spades in order so they're the only ones reversed. And there what? we have all the spades to match your six. Ace, two, three, four, five. Your six goes right there. Seven, eight, nine, ten, Jack, queen, king, ace. Ellen, now hold on. Walk with me. Ellen, come here. Walk with me. No, this is going to get good. Here, here's the deal. I love, I love Ellen's show, and I love everything about your energy. Grab that pen. I'm going to throw this ball into the crowd, and what I want somebody to do is uh, catch it. Oh, there you go. Cool. Stand up. Stand up. Oh, stop. Right there. All I want you to do is tell me the feeling that you have when you watch Ellen. Happy. Boom. Right there. Just write the word happy. All righty. Yes. I love it. Happy. Take that ball, and I want you to throw that ball to somebody else. Yes. OK, stand up. Stand up. Stand up. How does Ellen make you feel when you watch great. this show and you see her? Great. Great. Good. Right. Great. We have happy. We have great. So far, so good. Take that ball. Give it a heave. We have happy, we have great, that's a big toss. Oh, awesome, okay, stand up. What's your name? Maddie. Maddie, what's up, how you doing? Good. I want you to give me a feeling. When you watch Ellen, how does she make you feel? Excited. Excited, excited it is. We have happy, we have great, and we have excited. I love it. Why don't you throw the ball up here? Yeah. Perfect, that'll work. There's one thing I love about your show. On your show, you end it the same way every single time. Mm -hmm. You say, be kind to one another. Right. I think that's one of the most powerful messages there is. So do me a favor. Write, be kind to one another. Be kind to one another. We have a choice in this world, and we have a choice on how we choose people. Happiness is a decision. To feel great, it is, it's a decision. And to be excited, it's a decision that we all make every single day. And that comes from watching your show. And it motivates every single one of us to be great to one another. Awesome. I hope now, so. Yeah, yeah. Before we started, hold on. Before we started, I actually, uh, before we started, I was on the plane, and I'm sitting here thinking to myself, why is it, Ellen, that I actually get so excited to be on your show? And you know what? I made a, I made a list myself. And I thought, man, I tell you what, if I make this list, and, and why don't you hold this out for me right here? I thought to myself, first of all, I get more excited than anybody to come on your show. And your show makes me feel great. And when I feel great, I am so happy, Ellen, that I watch you. And all I can think to myself is I, too, will be kind to one another. Ladies and gentlemen, this is one of the greatest people in the world. I love it. Thank you. Be great. Be happy. Be excited. We're back with magician and Philadelphia Eagle, John Dorenbos, and we have another trick. Yeah, yeah. OK. Uh, same thing. Say stop. Stop. OK, take it. Look at it. Yep. Show the camera. 
I'm gonna show you guys a really cool move. Uh, a lot of people wanna know how do magicians get cards from the middle to the top, so I'm gonna show you. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna put it face up so everybody can see it. Okay. It, it helps me out too. Yeah, because <laughs> now you can see it. Yeah, yeah. I can see it. Uh, watch the hand. If you take it this way and you just cover it, see that's when your card will jump to the top from the middle. Now I, I know what you're thinking, that's called palming, and it is. So watch the queen, it's when I palm it off the top. Let me see your hand. And then that's when the queen will go. And that's when you can get it to disappear. Ah, so that's how he does it. Now here's a misnomer right here. Everybody thinks it's the top card. Everybody thinks it's the top card, but if you actually wait, it's actually the second card. You see the seven? It's when we just tap it that your queen will come back whenever we need it. We can get your queen to jump. Ah, so that's how he does it. Tell you what, <laughs> watch the queen. See it, watch the queen. We're gonna go here. Ellen, all I need you to do is snap your fingers in just a second. Watch the five, snap your fingers. When you snap, it jumps to the top whenever we need it. We can find it. Now, here's the deal, here's the deal. Uh, I, I love doing tricks and I love this, but see, the last time I was on your show, we, we had a picture. It's one of my favorite pictures. I think this is really cool. I want to bring it out and show everybody. It's actually a picture of you and I. But if you remember, I'm actually, you, you thought of the ten of spades. Yep. Do you remember that? Yep. Here, hold it just like this. Uh, I'm going to take your queen and, well, we're going to kind of make, make this up as we go here. Why don't you hold one of the corners? Um, the problem with this memory is when I look at it, it's, it's not up to date because there's a ten and you picked a queen. Mm -hmm. Make sense? Yeah. So if I hold the queen against the glass, watch. Hopefully we can get it to go through. See that? And see now I'm holding the, the, the queen there and we can actually go here too. And I actually thought, what the heck? We'll hold your, your, your corner as well. And see, that's me holding the queen and the corner and there's your picture just like that. Isn't that cool? No, I know what you're thinking. You're thinking that's not that good. But hey, I wanted to leave you with a memory because I have a memory and you have a memory. So I thought, you know what, what the heck? I thought I'd leave you with this as well. And I wanted you to have a picture just like I have a picture. And I wanted you to leave holding that queen just like the one I have at my house. Wow. Ladies and gentlemen, Ellen DeGeneres. Thank you.